The Foundations of Geometry by David Hilbert. Chapter 1 The Five Groups of Axioms. Section 1 The Elements of Geometry and the Five Groups of Axioms. Let us consider three distinct systems of things. The things composing the first system we will call points and designate them by the letters A, B, C, and so on. Those of the second we will call straight lines and designate them by the letters lowercase a, b, c, and so on. And those of the third system we will call planes and designate them by the Greek letters alpha, beta, gamma, and so on. The points are called the elements of linear geometry. The points and straight lines, the elements of plane geometry. And the points, lines, and planes, the elements of the geometry of space, or the elements of space. We think of these points, straight lines, and planes as having certain mutual relations, which we indicate by means of such words as are situated, between, parallel, congruent, continuous, etc. The complete and exact description of these relations follows as a consequence of the axioms of geometry. These axioms may be arranged in five groups. Each of these groups expresses by itself certain related fundamental facts of our intuition. We will name these groups as follows. 1. Axioms of connection. 2. Axioms of order. 3. Axioms of parallel. Euclid's axiom. 4. Axioms of congruence. 5. Axiom of continuity. Archimedes' Axiom The Foundations of Geometry by David Hilbert The material contained in the following translation was given in substance by Professor Hilbert as a course of lectures on Euclidean geometry at the University of Göttingen during the winter semester of 1898 and 1899. It was translated by E. J. Townsend, Ph.D., University of Illinois. The text was downloaded from Project Gutenberg with the following notice. This ebook is for the use of anyone anywhere in the United States and most other parts of the world at no cost and with almost no restrictions whatsoever. Read by Jim Renholt. Programming and illustrations by Jim Renholt. 2019. Portrait of David Hilbert by Rita Ray Renholt. Thank you for listening.